Thanksgiving. All right, some good news there for a Friday night. All right, let's now move on. And uh, Moses Owaga and his diving stable, Kenya Rescue Divers, have over the past one month made a mark in the Lake Nakuru chopper crash recovery mission. The helicopter plunged into the lake on October the 21st, killing all the five passengers on board. Victor Gale now brings us the story of the two divers who found the helicopter. Mohammed Abduhak and team leader of Kenya Rescue Divers Moses Owaga, who are under the Sonko Rescue Team stable after the discovery of the chopper. The team of five male and one female diver has been instrumental in the search of the ill-fitted chopper 5YNMG that plunged into Lake Nakuru on the 21st of October, killing all the five passengers on board. For Moses Owaga Omusa, as he is called by his peers, his quest underwater is one that means business, having saved numerous lives in his course of duty for over 30 years now. We are real, real, real players, no, international divers. To feel that we are not going to be able to do this. We are not going to be able to do this. We are not going to be able to do this. We are not going Kutoka ndana maja kijaju wali pigia maji na fraa sana. Moses, ndege, kali kali. Mkambia pana, we sa yungine mazimu wako siyamini. Wacha nende chini ni angani ya kikisha kama ni ndege oni vipi. Kachukua chupa ila mboko nao kambia nipe. Kangia pali ndani kwa kikisha kwa mba. Sio ni lete reporti kwa mba ni ndege na sio ndege sangeni gogo. Kufika chini kijangu papasa ni ndege. Kachukua kafunja kapisa size hapa. Kwa kuna nginia. Kaweka ndani ya boti. Kuweka ndani ya boti pale pale nikamwambia lete makboya tukafunga makboya pale. Mara nyingi sana tuki, tuki retrieve bodies from out of the water hatujailipwa. Siwezi kukuficha hatujailipwa. Ni tu ile pengine hizi gas hizi cylinders. Pengine watu wajitolea basi tujazie cylinders because kujaza cylinders only 500 shillings. Na mali tunaishi na mali tunajazwa ni mbali. So unakuta tu mtu anakupatia kama 1000 kujaza those cylinders but ku retrieve body kwa ndani ya maji hatujailipwa ndio. Born and raised in Mutongwe, Mombasa County, Musa began diving at the age of 10 in the Indian Ocean before taking up his passion as a full-time job, getting contracts as a seaman for cruise ships heading to the Middle East and Europe. His drive to become a life-saving diver was after the 1994 Mutongwe ferry tragedy, where over 250 people died. Fifteen years ago, he formed his diving team. He has previously worked with the Kenya Navy divers in numerous operations, and he has trained hundreds of divers across Kenya. Bada kuzama na watu, hiyo kitu nilipatia mutisha sana ku, masola rescue, kulisaidia watu wengi sana hapa. Nona, na badia wenga mbali lituwa kama ni maiti sasa. Kulengaga kwa tukombali, tukija pale, wanzeto wa shafariki. In 2009, he received the Silver Star Medal from former President Mwai Kibaki. And in 2010, the International Life Saving Federation awarded him the International Rescue Medal. His exploits under the water made him earn yet another international recognition in November last year when he received the Royal Medal of Merit from Queen Elizabeth at Buckingham Palace. In Sonko Rescue Team, Sonko Rescue Team, Mohamed Abduhak, Mohamed Rahim Nahim, Juma Omar, Mori Nonyango, and Buana Samata. Together with Musa Owago, will forever leave a mark in the lives of the family members that lost their loved ones in the crash. Victor.